I have a function generator connected to my picoscope oscilloscope, and right now it has what we call a bipolar signal on it. In other words, the, uh, the square wave goes low, it goes to minus 0.5, then it transitions to plus 0.5, so that means it has a peak-to-peak -peak voltage of 1. So what if I want a waveform that goes from 0 to 1 volts? And that could be useful in certain situations, like if we're testing a logical circuit, or we probably want to go from one to, or zero to five volts then. But say if we're doing something like our RC time constant lab, how do we remedy that? So you could use the function generator to put a DC offset on the waveform. So you go over to our function generator over here, you see there's this offset button, I could push that. Now it says my DC offset is zero, and that makes sense. And as I turn the knob right here, I put that on a more significant digit, Right there, the DC offset value goes up. Now, if I look over at the oscilloscope as I'm doing that, so now I have a DC offset of one half of a volt, and what that effectively means is that I've added a constant of 0.5 volts to the square wave, and now you can see the square wave starts at zero and it goes to one. So, if you're measuring a time constant, that's very useful because now if you're trying to figure out when you're you get to one time constant, you can instantly map it to, okay, when the voltage crosses 0.63 volts, that means I've gotten to one time constant. So once again, looking at the scope, you know, we use the DC offset button, we turn the knob right there. Now say if I want it to be all negative, go to minus 0.5, and now my high is at zero and my low is at negative one.